Hey, I'm Gabby, also known as Senorita Gavita. Welcome back, or if you're new here, welcome. In today's video, it will be like a monthly vlog about my life as an artist. I'm also working part-time at the museum. And I'm also a full-time student in art history right now. I'm doing my master thesis. And yes, I was showing you what I did at my workspace. And then after that, I have to go to university to attend my class and then after that after finally doing the busy stuff i'm going back at home and finally doing some art so now i want to do some sketching here on this side i already did here some with a type of markers from Pilot. They are also erasable. I really like them, but they can bleed a little bit through. So you can see here it shines a little bit through the paper, the illustration. So I don't want to destroy when I'm drawing on this side and the back side of this page because I have here my colored pencil illustration that I do mostly for my patron rewards. And so, because I don't want to um, destroy this illustration, I'm thinking to add a page or some pages of this pad that I have here laying around for almost a year or longer. The paper that I have here and for example, I have here already from the pad some pages that I use for color swatching and I want to reuse them here on my sketchbook. So I have here a second page that I can use and I think it fits almost perfectly here for the left side. And then I will also add a second page here because this marker, alcohol marker illustration pleats through the page and I want on this side also my colored pencil concept illustration. So I have a whole sketchbook spread with this type of illustration that I really love to do right now. So this is the next step that I'm doing. So I finished it. I added here the paper here as well. First, I want to do a sketch for August. Here in Germany, in August is still very warm. It's the end of the summer, beginning of the fall. So maybe I will stick to the beach theme. And I had the idea maybe to make a guinea pig swimming in the ocean or to draw a mermaid guinea pig. I remember that I have here a mermaid guinea pig and this illustration is I think one year or maybe two years old. I don't remember correctly. So maybe I will use the same color scheme or I will change the hair color to orange to make all the whole illustration more vibrant or I will stick to the brown and make the surrounding more vibrant. And I also remember that I have at my sticker, my new stickers on my sketchbook. I am adding here on the sketchbook all the stickers that I have done for my Patreon. And this is for June, a strawberry. I did for the sticker also some extra strawberries. Maybe I will add one of them. So I think this will be for the front side. And on the back side, I have here also two stickers. They are not for Patreon, but for an upcoming shop update. I'm doing in my free time some new sticker designs and for my shop, but it's still in a work in progress part because I don't have too much time sadly at the moment to work all the time that I have for my shop. So when I have a little bit time left, I'm creating some new stickers or art prints. So I really like it with all the stickers on the cover. It's very cute and fits perfectly. 
to the pastel um, book cover and maybe you want to have a sticker as well in your collection and if this is the case you can join my patreon each month you can receive a new sticker an art print or both together as a bundle After the brainstorming, I needed to record some content for a collaboration that I did with Ahuhu. The stand be the Honolulu 104 set and also a sketchbook and some gel pens. And for the collaboration, I have to do an unboxing as you can see and review the colors. And I did also a whole video where I show you how I used the Ohuhu markers for the first time. And if you are interested to see the whole process and how I draw in general with alcohol markers because I have a little bit of experience from the past. I drew a lot with alcohol markers but for the first time it was for Ohuhu and if you want to see the whole process you will find the video in the description down below or in the right side the info card. But after I have finished all the content creation I moved back to my sketchbook because I wanted to finish the thumbnail for my patreon rewards for the stickers and the art prints and as i showed you i have already done the brainstorming so i have the rough idea what i want to do and for the thumbnail i pick up all the colors that i have in mind or what i think will fit to this ma'am pick ocean illustration so there are a lot of greens and blues and also some very vibrant colors like orange for the hair and also for the sea star and then i did the coloration as you can see with colored pencil and then later i will add some highlights with a white acrylic pen as you can see here right now i really love to use it because it's very opaque and i can add the highlights very easily and precisely and i must say i was very happy with all this uh, illustration and with it with the drawing process because I really like the little mare mate or this here the little mare pig because it was one of my favorite movies in my childhood and I really adore the mare mate Ariel and yes after I have finished it I did off screen the digital part but I will soon show you my digital drawing process so I'm working right now like a tutorial video but now we are printing the sticker sheet and this time I decided to use a holographic laminate sheet for the stickers because I think it was fitting to the mermaid theme and as a freebies I picked up the fishes that you can see in the illustration and added there a glitter laminate sheet because I think it was very very cute to use this sparkling um, effect for the stickers and then after that we are moving to the art print and it's the same process i do the files on my pc and then i printed them cut them in the right size And if you like them, the art print and the stickers, you can receive them via my Patreon. You can join until the end of August to receive them and you can decide which tier you want to join. Maybe you want only the stickers, the art print or maybe both together as a bundle. So we are almost in the end of July and at the beginning of August and I did a lot of stickers. You can see that I did the new rewards for patreon and now we are printing and cutting some stickers for the previous reward for july because at the first week of august i sent out all the um the patreon orders that i got and i didn't have the time at the middle of july to make the freebie stickers so i'm doing them very quickly and maybe you can remember that for July it was a cute guinea pig at a beach and building a sandcastle. So I thought it was very cute to make ice creams like a freebie sticker. So there are different flavors, chocolate, strawberry and vanilla. And then I cut them 
with my Cricut machine and also thinking because I have so many of this ice cream stickers to offer them in my first shop update what I'm doing right now I'm working on a lot of different kind of stickers and yes and as I said my shop update will come soon I'm still working on it so you will see also that in my free time and sometimes it's very late at night that I'm doing some work for it like here you can see that I'm working with Photoshop and Illustrator I scanned some of my sketchbook spread that I did and this sketchbook spread um, was with um, ink uh, with the orange ink and the green ink and it was also for the collaboration that I did in the past and I really love it and a lot of you really like them the cats especially the tomato cat and that's why I thinking to do a bundle with all the cats and make stickers out of it as i said the first week of the month and in this case the first week of august i am packing the orders for patreon i'm packing all the art prints stickers and adding in each one of them the freebie stickers the ice cream that i did very quickly and Yes, I'm very happy to receive my Patreon orders. I'm very grateful for each one of you with your help and with your support. I'm able to do this YouTube videos, to create art and to pursue my dream to make this type of work like my part-time or maybe also my full-time job in the future. And yes, thank you so much for helping me out. And I don't have too much to say about just packing part of my monthly routine. It's very calming and I'm doing all the time the same steps. Adding the thank you cards and closing all the envelopes with cute washi tapes. And yes, I hope you like this type of video. I would love to show you more about my workspace because it's very interesting when you are into art history but I can't show you that much because I have to keep all the guidelines from my workspace in mind and this is also with my university stuff I can't show you that much but this is a very kind of sneak peek that I'm doing also monthly and but I'm thinking to do this more this type of vlog video where I show you some some insights in my life maybe when i go to a museum to an exhibition or when i'm going to a cafe doing my stickers and art prints for patreon recording a little bit for my content creation for instagram when i'm working with collaboration working on my shop update and so on so it will be like a monthly summary about my life and i hope you will like this type of vlog so i'm leaving you with the last parts of the packing i hope you like this video and if you like it don't forget to leave a thumb up don't forget to subscribe and push the notification bell so you don't miss any new videos from me and until the next video please stay safe and healthy bye bye